Welcome to London. Our tour begins with the London Eye, Europe's tallest observation wheel. It's the most famous scenic viewpoint in the capital, with a height of 135 meters. Starting at Big Ben, that is hidden under the scaffolding, we invite you to have a ride on a double-decker through Westminster Bridge. This kind of bus is a convenient way to have a look at the city and its main sites. Look at the sky. Airplanes are leaving colorful trails behind them in honor of the Queen Elizabeth II's birthday. On this bridge, there's always a lot of tourists and attraction points with a bagpipe among them. One of the most ancient musical instruments and the national instrument of Scotland. Tower Bridge is a marvel of engineering. With a total length of 244 meters, it opens within a minute. Even then, pedestrians could cross the river through a special walkway. But since 1982, these walkways have been used as a museum and a viewpoint. The tower is one of the most ancient buildings in London. It's believed to be founded by William I. For more than a thousand years, it had been a fortress, a palace, a treasury, an armory, the royal mint, a prison, and an observatory. In the 13th century, one of the towers served as a menagerie with a bear that went fishing in the Thames. We're in front of the Westminster Scholars' War Memorial and Westminster Abbey, a beautiful Gothic church. The Abbey, together with the Palace of Westminster, was designated a UNESCO World Heritage Site in 1987. The Abbey is a traditional site for the coronation events and a burial place for British monarchs. Feast your eyes on its country yard, surrounded by cloister galleries. Unfortunately, the main premises are prohibited to be photographed, even with a mobile phone. In front of us is the famous Buckingham Palace. It was built as a private residence for the Duke. Afterwards, it was acquired and rebuilt by King George III and it became the official residence of the British monarchy on the accession of Queen Victoria only in 1837. In London, there are many wild animals, such as squirrels, parrots, foxes and deers, that are getting on well in this metropolis. We were lucky to meet a squirrel in Hyde Park. In Trafalgar Square, there is a national gallery that is among the world's five most popular art museums. One can visit it like many other London museums, free of charge. On top of the 17 meters high Ludgate Hill, there is St. Paul's Cathedral. It is the fifth Christian church on this site. One of the previous was destroyed by the Vikings. Others were burned down in a fire. The present cathedral was completed in 1708. Now it is the residence of the Bishop of London.
front of Tate Modern, a museum of contemporary art, and the Millennium Bridge, built in honor of the third millennium. It was also featured in such movies as Harry Potter, Love Actually, and Black Mirror TV series. Just behind the World War II battlecruiser HMS Belfast, you can see the highest skyscraper in the UK, the Shard, rising at 309 meters. Thank you for this journey made with Air Banner.